Hello, my wonderful uh, dear friends, my Igbo lady, and also my South Eternacy, my fellow Igbo people. Anyway, we are there. Good morning. Once again, I mean, I'm here. The cutting line from the platform of Okute Daily Talk. The matter where we carry come for now this uh, Monday morning, though, this one in the matter of uh, Imo State, the land of hope. That uh, the so called hopeless use of danger, the governor of Imo State have turned it to land of hopeless, which is very, very bad. According to our papers, who's of them, a guy you blown up. My dear, it's not a guy who's of them, in the other way around, it is who's of danger, who's of the home, and we can never go eat again. According to the headline we have here, Imo State uh, November 11 governorship election and the many unforgiving sense of hopeless uh, who's of danger. This, uh, this is what we are about to expose in case of people who are clamoring for this uh, um, this uh, mistake of a human being to come back again as a governor of Imo State. It will be a nightmare for the whole Imo life if they allow this man again to continue this impunity. Because the agenda which is signed from the uh, sign for the Fulani Kabas is not yet complete, uh, completed. That is why you see the so called uh, Mr. Dekunle said uh, he is behind, uh, strongly behind Hope of the That means it's a nightmare uh, people of Imo State is about to witness, which we can never allow that to happen. Anyway, my wonderful people, now here we will test start this our news. I beg, remember that uh, slogan and uh, the, the, the campaign. For Bia France, I still going on. I beg you, any of my content you come across, whether old or new, keep on commenting. I stack Bia France to the world. I stack um, on Mazin Namdekano's mandate, which is stand. I stack release Mazin Namdekano now. I see tag all hell Bia France. Now, so it will take B. So, anyhow, where you take the, 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 the feed one, even if you like, you can comment as many times as possible. It doesn't. Uh, Add anything to you, neither does it uh, cost you anything. But to let the international community know that their friends are ready to go, they are ready to take their destinies by their own hands. So, anyhow, we did. I beg go make on a gather here because this news is going to be uh, a very, very uh, strong one. Oh, if uh, I'm uh, allowed to say, well, uh, please uh, remember to share this message, like on it, comment on it, and make sure you subscribe to my channel because uh, the delay is can never be a denial. We are the, at the Biafra Post news outlet and all writing to show interest on the Nigerian government corrupt uh, electoral system or to pick a stand. But to set some record straight uh, by calling Spade a Spade, we must uh, start by addressing and calling out the many sins and the calam cal calamitous act or calamitous act of uh, the Supreme Court uh, administrator of Imo State, hopeless, who's a danger whose case has been one of the many reasons the world says Nigeria judicial system and her Supreme Court as a non-independent tool working for the corrupt executive arm of the Nigeria government or Nigeria country. We will never forget in a hurry how the late chief of staff or to the tyrant Mahmoud Buhari's APC ruthless administrator or administration, Mr. Abakiari, then the anchor man of the Nigerian presidency after the death of dictator Muhammad Buhari uh, and how uh, Tanku uh, Mohammed, the Fulani Sharia court judge, was imposed on Nigerians as a chief justice of Nigeria. We call, okay, we recall how Tanku Mohammed managed to rig in a hopeless or danger into Imo State government house by manipulating the result with the help of some uh, INEC staff through the cover of a Supreme Court order, was imposed on Ndibo against the collective uh, wishes and the decisions of uh, Ndibo state just to help the Fulani government of Nigeria to facilitate the invasion, Fulanization and Islamization agenda of the Fulanis in Igbo land. But we have conquered them. As long as Biafra is still alive and still intact, my dear, all these people, they are just, uh, they are, the fact they are, they are dead on arrival, Imo State is the eastern heartland. The Fulanis knows very well that planting an agent of destruction and is Islamization, a swindler, as a governor, will pave way for them and help hasten their march towards the Atlantic Ocean. But many, but funny enough, 
When the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Mazin Namdekano, said on a live broadcast on Radio Biafra that the Fulani Jihadist government of Nigeria can never take over or conquer an inch from Biafra land. They thought he was a, he was joking, but reason, hope, who's a danger or hopeless is a danger, walked tirelessly round the clock to see that the British and Nigerian government kidnapped Mazin Namdekano on a trip to Kenya. We know about all this. With the help of some uh, corrupt uh, politicians, uh, both in Kenya and Nigeria and Britain, Mazen Namdekano was extraordinary rendition to Nigeria just to cage him and give way for the full and terrorist invasion of Biafra land. The Nigeria and British government, uh, through the supervision of a uh, hopeless who's a ginger planted uh, many agent provocateurs, most and infiltrators in IPOB, just to destroy the IPOB leadership directorate of state, DOS. The Eastern Security Network, ESN, and, and the wave and force of the IPOB media warriors, but to their chagrin and greatest surprisation, they failed woefully and keep on failing. The late IPOB and the ESN commander, Ikonso, made sure that every foreign terrorist parading as helmsmen in Imo State were chased away from Imo. Ikonso fought in security gallantly in Imo State. He put uh, his life on the line to make sure that. Uh, Imo State is free from the hands of the Fulani invaders who were busy killing, uh, pledging, and mamming our people, raping our mothers in their farmlands, kidnapping for ransom, snatching of cows, and defiling our ancestral land. We are all sent packing and departed from Imo State. This uh, outsmarting performance by Ikonso and his men got the Nigerian government inflated. As uh, their plans for Ruka settlements in Imo State failed woefully. Hopeless Uzo Jinjo, being a pupil of the Fulani Uligachi master, minded the killing of Ikonso on the 24th day of April of 2021, a very sad Saturday. They traced him to his father's compound in our mama, and uh, he was uh, gruesomely murdered in his sleep. We are IPOP, we don't forget and we don't forgive. On hope, Uso Danger, desperate moves to nail and tarnish the image of IPOP ESN and Martin Namdekano, they ended up spilling the blood of Ahmed Gulak on the May 30th of 2021 in Owe. The Nigerian Gota, uh, Gota media houses tried all they could to blackmail and hang it on IPOP, and IPOP substantiated them with evidences, which truncated the, the ulterior motives behind the killing of Ahmed Gulak. This same hopeless Uzo Dinjo invited Abia carry the Super Cup into Imo State. He was responsible for the forceful disappearance of uncountable Imo youths, burning of Ndibu houses and properties. Some of these youths were dispatched to numerous prisons and underground cells in the northern Nigeria, where some of them were extrajudicially executed and their organs harvested for illicit money. Before Abakiari was indicted by the U.S. FBI for corruption and drug-related offenses, the God of Biafrans are truly fighting for them. Because if Abakiari were to be alive or were to be around in these uh, circumstances, I can tell you the truth, my dear. Imo youth self, oh, the thing we have to escalate from uh, Imo to Anambara and the rest of the state is not safe. The God of the Biafrans is still alive. Chuko Biama is not sleeping. What is happening today between Israel and Palestine? Hamas, who have been a child's play to watch the full and jihadist government of Nigeria, was planning against the Biafrans and the entire southeastern Nigeria, exempting the western Nigeria, despite the sudden kidnap and the extraordinary rendition of uh, IPOP leader Namdekano. The IPOP worldwide as a movement and her formidable leadership has stood in the gap to make sure that Biafra land is protected of the vampire in Imo State government house. Hopeless Uzo Dinjo and his Fulani Jihadis. The saddest and sorrowful day was on the 14th January 2020 for Ndibo. It was the very day of a fanatically corrupt Supreme Court of Nigeria imposed a Imo vampire called Hopeless Uzo Dinjo on Ndimo. So-called Governor Hopeless Uzo Dinjo has succeeded in forcefully silencing every traditional ruler in Imo State who stood against his murderous regime. He had been sponsoring political assassinations here and there. He invited the toad in the creek called Asari Dokobo with his criminal gangs into Imo State 
to be committing all sort of criminalities. He has made the Imo State the hard base of the chief infiltrator and his criminal gangs, making life so miserable for Ndibu. They steal, they kidnap for ransom, snatching of cars, raping of a woman, and threatening Ndibu, claiming to be ESN while they are not. The sins of uh, this uh, Imo State vampire is unimaginable and accountable. For those who are still willing to vote, vote wisely and save Imo lives and properties. Biafra self determination remains our only hope as high public leadership and Mazen Nam Dekano awaits Nigeria on the negotiation table for Biafra referendum date. Let's be guided and let records for those so called Igbo politicians and the uh, Otalectuas uh, <laughs> who claims they go to school but they, don't, they know nothing. The days of the recording is fast approaching. The same way we shall testify for or against each and every one of those Igbo politicians who says nothing when all these killings is going on in our land simply because they have eaten the forbidden fruit. Biafra is our land and our last hope. All hail Biafra, Biafra to the world and Biafra to the moon. Whether the devil like it or not, we must surely conquer. Whether the Nigerian government like it or not, we must surely conquer. Whether the so-called Fulani Kabas like it or not, Biafra is the last hope of every, every Igbo man or every South Easterner. Believe it or believe it. It may not be now, but it must surely come to pass. All hell Biafra and all hand must be on desk to make sure that this our dreams comes true. Every other thing that is coming from the Nigerian government to the Biafra land is dead on arrival and they can never be tolerated. So my wonderful people, like, share, comment, turn on the notification button, be notified time we go live, or we post something on this channel or another channel related to Okute Daily Talk. Keep on liking, keep on subscribing, keep on sharing. Make sure you keep that hope alive of Biafra to the moon, Biafra to the world. All hell Biafra. Keep on uh, writing all these uh, slogans. The campaign is still on, and it continues to be on until Martin Nam the is freed and Biafra is restored. Whether they like it or not, even the United Nations and the so-called UK, whether they like it or not, because of our mineral resources and our raw materials they are taking from our land, that is why you see every one of them are silent. Anyway, my wonderful people, be blessed here. I go take leave on and make on a control, subscribing, liking, commenting, and make sure today being Monday, you do what? Ibuko to go Kabiama to guide your ways in all you are doing, in any way you are going. Because without Tuko Kabiama, we have nothing on this earth. They are the originator of everything we have on this planet Earth. So have a nice day. I'm a good Lord. Continue to bless each and every one of us. I am signing out. Bye for now, my wonderful people. Okay, Messiano.